Hello Lake County, it's the Lake County Flash for Friday, September 9th, 2022. Here is your video news source for everything Oregon Outback, it's the Flash. Ronnie Sharp recently opened the little store Home Decor and More at 23 Southeast Street in Lakeview. Sharp was compelled to start the new business after he needed to buy a phone charger for his car and was shocked at the retail price. He decided then and there to build his new and used business locally. Dave Schnur bought the building in 2021, and together he and Sharp remodeled the entire store before opening. The business that previously occupied the space many years ago was called The Store. Sharp wanted to keep an important part of Lakeview's history, so he only changed the name slightly to The Little Store. Items for sale include clothing, household items, backpacks, new and used bikes, knickknacks, handmade picture frames, paper mache masks, unique garden pots, and more. The Barnes fire burning 17 miles south of Lakeview was reported to have grown to 4,035 acres as of Thursday night, September 8th. The fire started on Wednesday, September 7th at approximately 4 p.m. due to lightning, according to Cal Fire. As of Friday morning, September 9th, an evacuation warning was in effect for Fort Bidwell and an evacuation advisory in effect for Willow Ranch. According to the Modoc County Sheriff's Office, an evacuation shelter has been opened at the Modoc Fairgrounds in Cedarville. Modoc County Social Services and Modoc County Health Services are staffing the shelter with assistance from Modoc OES with logistics. The High Plateau Humane Society has opened an animal shelter at the same site. Red Cross has been deployed and will arrive Saturday to take over the shelter. See the Modoc County Sheriff's Office Facebook page for more information. The J. Maharms Memorial Scholarship was established in 1996 in memory of former 4-H member J. Maharms, who died in October of 1995. Each year since then, a lamb or pig has been raised by a Lake County 4-H member and auctioned off at the 4-H and FFA livestock sale. This year's J. Maharms Scholarship auction lamb was donated by Becca Lucas and raised by Amelia Swartz. It sold for $1,300. To date, the fund has given out over $130,000 to Lake County 4-H members who have graduated from high school and are furthering their education. Eight recipients received scholarships from the fund this year. They are Allison Yates, Sarah Thiel, Hope Brain, Rachel Cahill, Emily Philibert, Zach Reese, Patience Half, and Russell Brown. With 174 youth participating in this year's Lake County 4-H and FFA market sale, total funds brought in amounted to $631,834. The sale was held on Saturday, September 3rd and packed the round barn at the Lake County Fairgrounds. The sale provides youth in 4-H and FFA a place to sell the livestock projects that they've raised over many months. Many of the youth reinvest the money they receive for their projects in better livestock or in their college fund. Species categories included beef, swine, goat, sheep, poultry, and rabbits. Full market sale results and photos of Grand and Reserve champions will appear in the September 14th edition of The Examiner. That does it for this week. Be sure to check out the online calendar to keep up with events happening around the county. Catch a new flash every Friday, the Lake County Hotspot every Tuesday, and for these stories and much more, be sure to pick up a copy of the next Lake County Examiner. Believe it or not, the end of summer is near, but don't stress because Ace Hardware has everything you need to prepare your yard for fall. Like Scott's Turf Builder Winter Guard Fall Weed and Feed, just $29.99 a bag. And for those plants, pick up some miracle Grow Moisture Control Potting Mix, two cubic feet for $14.99. To keep pests at bay, Ace has Ortho Home Defense Insect Killer for indoor and perimeter, only $11.99. Scott's Easy Seed is also on sale at $29.99 a bag. Stop in today to see how Ace can help you with your yard as the seasons change. And remember, Ace is the place with the helpful hardware folks.